Uh, it feels good get that first win out of the way. Um, not quite how I wanted to win, but you know I'll take it. It was a good. It was a good battle. Uh, what was it about Sansbury that made it difficult? More just, just a tough guy. You know he came out there to fight, and that's what he did. Um, I know he's a hardworking, humble guy, and you know he's. It's tough to take those guys out. Uh, I actually trained at Jackson Wink MMA this time in Albuquerque. Uh, I live in South Dakota, but I've been doing my camps in Albuquerque at Jackson Wink, and. You know, just the the caliber of coaching and the caliber of guys that train there. It's just uh, it's it's a it's a compound of, of tough fighters. So um, it's a well well oiled machine. You see more than willing to uh, stand and bang with him. Was that part of the game plan, or something that you saw in him that may that might work in your favor if he did? Oh, uh, you know, I thought I could knock him out, um, but I guess that wasn't the case. You know, we traded heavy shots, and you know, it was it was a lot of fun. I must say. What was the difference in this camp and the last one? I think some people maybe thought you may be tired out a little bit more on the last one. Was that something you really worked for on this one? Was, it, um, the cardio, was that the difference in this one? I always, uh, you know, I always work, you know, work my cardio hard. Last time I cut a lot of weight. That was at 185 pounds. This one's at 205. You know, so I came in a lot bigger and probably a little bit more healthy, you know, without that uh, extra weight cut. So I, th that, I think that might have been the difference. How good does it feel to be at this weight? You know, it feels good. Uh, I still cut from, you know, I started at 230 pounds, so, you know, I'm, I'm not, not a little dude for the division by any means. Uh, I just disguise it in my legs, so, um, but it feels great to be at 205. And now that you got the, the first win, I mean, I know a lot of, it's, it's early to, to say, who, who do you want to be there? You know, how long do you want to get back in? But how soon do you want to get back in there? Is there guys that you're uh, on, the, on the pecking order that you're hoping for? You know, as soon as possible, and I'll fight whoever, and the, the better the opponent, the better it's going to make me train, and, you know, the better I'll perform. So, you know, I know I got some work to do, but that work's going to be put in, and I'm going to come back bigger, stronger, and faster. Uh, just some bruises, you know, uh, bruised my leg and my foot. You know, I was, I was trying to hurt him with, with all my strikes, so I was throwing a little bit of everything into it. And, you know, you just you catch it the, the right way, and you get bruised up or broken. So, um, you know, nothing that won't heal up. I th a week or two, and I'll be good to go. You hit, you hit him with a couple of clean shots in the fight. Were you surprised that he was still there and it took him pretty well? He took him really good. Um, you know, I didn't, I didn't finish. I should have finished up with him with another strike. So, you know, that's what happens when you don't finish up. Uh, just those, those big hits hurt. But you know, one or two more, he would have been out.